Good morning, Just for Sweets here again. I have another fun little uh, centerpiece or just candle to put out. Uh, just something really quick and easy. These are just fun little different things you can do. Um, these would also be really good centerpieces at a shower or a wedding. Um, not, not specifically in these containers, but you get the idea. You can put it in any container you wish. And actually, I think it would look really pretty in a size up mason jar or even a giant mason jar. But it has to do with coffee. And who doesn't love the smell of coffee? I don't think there's very many people that don't like the smell of coffee. Not everybody has to like coffee, but the smell of coffee is one of those things that just is an eye opener and wakes you up. Unfortunately, I have to have my two cups every morning. So, anyway, all you need for this, it's very simple a container of your choice, some little vanilla scented tea light candles, or any scent that you wish. I mean, if you can find like hazelnut ones or, or whatever you can find, get one that smells though, not an unscented candle because you're trying to bring out different smells in the coffee. And I have a big giant bag of coffee beans on. These are my own personal beans that I grind every day for my coffee, but I'm gonna use them for this display. So it doesn't have to be that big. You can buy a small bag. Uh, you want it to be kind of a strong coffee so that you can get that that uh, smell of the coffee, the aroma going. And so I have a French roast, which is a strong a strong blend. So let's get started. All you have to do is open your coffee beans, pour them in the container of your choice. I'm going to show you both. This is just a little tiny mason jar that had some of Linda's garlic powder in it and uh, we're just going to fill those right up to your desired level. It can be half of that, it can be more and then just kind of create a little center right there or you can make it flat. Tea lights will fit in anything but I'm going to kind of cover up the, the metal a little bit and go around it. And like I said, feel free to, I mean, a really, a big mason jar would look beautiful. Any size mason jar would look really pretty. If you're into the mason jar thing, like I know a lot of people are, you know, you can, there, you can use them for so many different things. So there's two different sizes and go ahead. And now if you wanted to put like a bow or some kind of decoration on it, you could, but I really want the, the coffee beans to stand out. So I'm leaving it just the way it is and we're going to go ahead and light our little tea lights and the good thing about the tea lights is once the wax is gone they put themselves out of course you should never leave a candle unattended whether it's a tea light or not um, you know you could cause major fires but these are you know these are pretty safe candles but like I said just keep an eye on them so there you go that is a beautiful uh, centerpiece um, you could put it in a bigger vase or bigger container or let's say you're just having coffee with a friend and you want your house to keep smelling of coffee, you go ahead and light this a little bit before they come over. And, and there you go, uh, baby shower, bridal shower, anything. And these are just a beautiful little centerpiece. And after they burn for about 20 to 30 minutes and those beans get going, and with me using a vanilla scented, coffee, or a vanilla scented um, candle, you might start smelling the taste or not the taste, I'm sorry. I'm trying to get you centered here on the light. Um, you might start you know, smelling that vanilla coffee flavor and it's just such a yummy, it just, I don't know, it just wakes you up. You know what I mean. It's like boulders in your cup, right? <laughs> anyway, so there you go. There's a beautiful centerpiece. I'm gonna turn off my light so you can see it. And it's good just to make that house smell really good and, and good for any occasion. So I had fun with this. It's just a few, you know, a few little ingredients to make some, something beautiful that smells great. And it's just something easy and, and unique. So I hope you have a wonderful day. And until next time, God bless.